Pansy. I was on the phone for at least two hours yesterday. I don't know what day it is. I've been on the phone for two hours. I don't even know who I'm talking to. Hey, how you doing, love, mama? Let me whisper in your ear. In North Carolina isn't Ukraine. I'm sorry, what? It's about to get all stupid up in here! Biden, it seems like you're jumping the gun when it oh no, pun intended, when it comes to Ukraine. But when it comes to North Carolina, you're nowhere to be found. What's going on? Tell us what's happening. Why weren't you and Vice President Harris here in Washington commanding this? Yeah, why were you guys why were you guys in the White House commanding this? It seems like a devastating act. What were you doing? What were you up to, you sick, sick old man? I was commanding. I was on the phone for at least two hours yesterday and the day before as well. He was on the phone for two hours. I command. It's called a telephone. Is it it's called a telephone. Read a, read a book. He was on the phone. And it's weird. Even Kamala Harris put out a little statement saying exactly the same thing. I was just briefed by FEMA, Chris, on the latest developments of the ongoing impacts of the Hurricane Hannah. Helene. We also discussed the administration. I spoke with NC Governor Cooper on the ongoing rescue efforts. And here's a picture of her on the phone. So both of them were on the phone. Okay, guys? So why don't you guys let up about it? And they posted their own pictures about it. <laughs> um, <laughs> do you hear that? Oh, we have her on the phone right now. Kamala, what do you... Um, <laughs> Kamala, <laughs> you're on the phone too? Yeah, I'm on the phone. Oh, great. That's so great to hear that you're on the phone. Are you going to help out FEMA and all? No, it, FEMA, North Carolina isn't Ukraine. I'm sorry, what? Yeah, North Carolina is a sovereign country, and they can do it themselves. Actually, North Carolina is, um, it's in the United States. No, and I'm going to make a Venn diagram to prove that you have no idea what you're talking about. Okay. Is there any way we could talk to Joe Biden about this? Mm, yeah, let me get him. Okay, great. <sighs> it's me! Hey, what's up, Joe? Um, just trying to figure out what's going on, man. Yeah, man, me too. I don't know what day it is. I've been on the phone for two hours. I don't even know who I'm talking to. Well, <laughs> you've been on the phone for two hours. Yeah, man, I'm so confused. How did even this phone works, man? Uh, I'm sure. Are you talking to anyone? No, I've just been on this phone for two hours. I can't get off the phone. Okay, so what's happening? Yeah, I'm just doing these photo ops on the phone. Okay, that's great to hear. Okay, there you go. There you go, right-wingers. They're on the phone. I mean... <laughs> Joe was busy planning his trip to East Palestine, says Disco Plus, exactly. Uh, I just love how he turns around and yells at everyone. Why weren't you and Vice President Harris... Here in Washington, commanding this. Why, yeah, why weren't you guys commanding this while, you know, a huge devastation everywhere? There's devastation happening everywhere in the United States. What was going on? This weekend. I was commanding. I was on the phone for at least two hours yesterday and the day before as well. I command. It's called a telephone. It's, it's called a telephone. Is it not important for the country to see? <laughs> he just turns around and leaves. Oh, God. Could you imagine if Trump did that? If Trump was in power, what the media would say about him? What the media would absolutely say? Gotta join FEMA Prime for the next day relief, says Jake M. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I love that both of the times he's like, I was on the phone. <laughs> I, his anger and dementia is like ramping up to a 10 and i don't know if kamala harris and, and and joe biden both had the same managers that manage their own social media they're like let's put a let's um let's just put a photo out guys let's let's get together let's put a photo out showing how hard you're working let's show you working uh we'll have you writing down on a piece of paper using a blue pencil pen who uses a blue pen 
psychopaths. No one uses a blue pen. Only people use blue pens ironically. I'm gonna come. Unreal. And one, <laughs> one, <laughs> one headphone in. Again, this is the devastation that's actually happening with Kamala Harris and Joe Biden doing absolutely nothing. But you can't stop it because we got to stop Donald Trump. We got to stop Donald Trump at all costs. I mean, and here's Donald Trump in North Carolina doing exactly what they should be doing. Talking with people, seeing people. And what the left will say is that, oh my God, he's using this as a prop. He's literally using this as a political prop. Like, yeah, that's what a politician does, but why aren't they doing it? Because they don't care.